Hey everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today we will learn how to create CSS glowing icon. If you are ready to learn how to create this stunning icon, so keep watching. Let's get started. Here we have a div element with the class attribute set to container. Next we have a link that is from found some library on a hosted on a CDN. Fontasm is a popular icon font library that provides scalable vector icon. Next here we represent the apple icon and the class fa and fa apple are a part of font awesome library. Specifying which icon to display. And here we set the id attribute when apple. Similar to the previous line, this, this one adds a tutor icon with the unique id attribute of tutor. Next we add a github icon with a unique id attribute of github. And the last we add a code pen icon with a unique id attribute of code pen. Now let's set CSS. Here we have a universal selector. We set the margin and the padding to 0. Next, let's add a body element. We set the height to 100 vh. Width is set to 100 vw. And the background is set to shade of a dark shade of grey color. Now let's tell the container. Here display is set to flex. Justify content and align item is set to center. Height is set to 100 vh. And width is set to 100 vw. So that it ensures that the container covers the entire viewport. Now let's tell the ID attribute that is uh, Apple, Twitter, GitHub, and CodePen. Here font size is set to ATM. So it makes the icon larger. Background color is set to dark gray color. Color is set to white. And here we create a multi layer sh shadow effect for the icon. It add outer shadow with various offset and blur values and also add inner shadow using the inset UI.
Next we set the border radius to 29 pixel so that it rounded the color of the icon. Padding is set to 11 pixel and 19 pixel so that it add internal spacing around the icon and the margin is set to 0 and 40 pixel so we provide horizontal spacing between the icon and the animation is set to apply animation to the icon so that it make them change color over a 3 second period in a continuous loop next we add a text shadow to the icons with varying blur values creating a glowing effect Here we set the Twitter icon that start the animation after 0.3 second. Next we have a GitHub icon. That start the animation after 0.7 second. And we and then we have a code pen icon. They start the animation after 0.1 second. Now let's set keyframe. Here we set the filter property. That rotates the hue of the icon from 0 degree that is red and to from 360 degree red again creating a continuous color cycle so that's it for today's video if you enjoy this video and learn something new don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more web development tutorials